Welcome back. This is Deep Waters with Deborah Waters. I can see you guys are loving this topic. You're loving the show and you can't even wait for me to get back from the from the short break and you're already bombarding me with calls like Deborah, I need to talk. I want to talk about this boot licking. Oh, Deborah, I'm a boot licker. Deborah, it has worked for me. Deborah, boot licking has not worked for me. Oh, be who you are. God be judge. Ah, I don't hear differences on this first segment, but happily we are on the second segment of the show and I can't wait to hear from you, my listeners and viewers. Before we actually get to picking more calls, um, let me remind you that we're talking about boot lickers. We're talking about in the journey of getting to the top, does boot licking play a major, major role? And thankfully, I've heard from the boot lickers and the boot lickies, the owner of the boots, have also said... And boot licking is loyalty to them. Would they would rather promote a person that is boot licking in their business than somebody who is just working hard and not boot licking because you, you know, sucking up to them and putting extra efforts means that, you know, you're loyal and you miss that to whom more is given, more is actually going to be expected. Ah, uh, contrasting opinions there. Well, uh, we're going to get more of these conversations in a bit. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm right here with a very special guest with me in the studio. An MC, a hype man, a music a and R, a nightlife influencer, a social media influencer, a big G, a chairman. And I'm just thinking, oh, as a hype man, this guy just sneaked in like so calmly, so calm, so chill. I'm like, I was trying to understand how does, how do you, <laughs> like, when I see him on stage and this person is like two different people. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm right here in the studio with mc fish <laughs> yeah 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 aka fisaya right aka y michael yes, aka yes. olaguju <laughs> yes 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 yeah, the way you're healing me i think i need to no, i need to go and... now see you now you you now go now i know no no you, know, no, no, you no. are the boots licky you are the owner of the boots here nah, i'm not the owner of any where boots where you see the beards here you know them they are, this they is just style people. this is just that you know where we go we have to show ourselves that we're creatives too <laughs> You know, creatives has a, we have a way of standing out okay. with our appearances. Okay, so, yeah. good to have you, MC. It's fish a pleasure. Building. It's a pleasure. Yeah, it's a pleasure. Sure, I mean, are you selling fish, Ni? Abi, is it meat you are selling? Uh, well, my name is Fisayo, so <laughs> Fisayo fish, fish. I'm just joking. I, I could not know that. But the chop, are the chop fish, shall we? Which type of fish in the chop? Ah, anyone, croaker, catfish, mangala, mangala, bubwe, ah, bonga. You know bonga fish. I've <laughs> chopped bonga fish before. <laughs> Energy Opo, good to have you in the studio. Yep, yep, so, thank yeah, you. So yeah, we're talking about boot lickers today. And I want to ask, uh, <laughs> as somebody who has dealt with somebody, or with all manner of people, or somebody mm -hmm. who has actually grown, mm -hmm. you know, from the, the very beginning, because I also read your bio on social media of how you actually started, yep. you know, and you climbed right there to the top, you yep. know. And I know there's still more for you to climb. But, you I'm, know, just I'm just getting started. I'm just starting. You're just getting started. <laughs> yeah. and, oh, so you just, you've climbed. And in, the, in your journey into getting to the top, so far for you have you had to boot leak i i have had to and i didn't like it wow yeah because uh how would i say this now i'm i'm someone that believes in okay you can get to anywhere you go to if you just believe in yourself all you need is you yourself and your god well, is that really true especially um, in this, our industry what people fail to understand is people will always come around to help you out in your life journey there are people that are there to, you know, that are at some specific points in your life, they are just there to help you out, to try to direct you into your journey. Without example, boot licking or with boot licking? Uh, without. Okay. Without. You understand? Mm -hmm. So, boot licking now, you have, you have you have brought yourself out there saying that, oh, okay, I don't have that self-esteem, you know, I don't believe in my work by myself, I have to do something extra to climb to the top. No, you don't need to do something extra to climb to the top. Just do your job diligently and you know pray to your god and you'll be see you'll be fine as long as as long as you are diligent in what you're your doing your guys at the top are not going they're not understanding this so somebody who owns a business actually yeah. called him to say that um so imagine you have you have a company of people now mm -hmm. and everybody's working hard yes right so uh, somebody is working hard the other person is working hard and boot licking who are you most likely to to to, to, to give the promotion uh, or who are you most likely uh, to help well if it's my business i'll i'll base it on i like to base merits on performance on outstanding performance uh -huh. she understands uh -huh. so out of if there are five thousand employees there'll be one employee that stands out which is the one sucking up to you no not it doesn't have to suck how up will to you stand up when you're not always at the office to know whether 
who is this? Who is working hard? Who's not? Everybody is working hard. He's the one that will check on you. Oga, where you there? Ah, Oga, do you need anything? No, ah, Oga, let me help you. I'm still, I'm still, I'm still, I'm, 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 I still agree with that. You don't have to come here and check up on me to for me to know that you're doing your job. I would know. I just have a way of doing it. <laughs> so, like I said, I, I'm, okay. I'm the type of person that believes in. Okay, like for example, now when, when I came onto the hype scene, mm -hmm. you know, hype was regarded as noise. Uh, I were just some few guys that were doing it right, you know. So I decided to just, you know, come out with my own type of thing, you know, and just follow it through. Yeah, it was hard. It was hard, but I, I was rewarded in the end because. I, I owe no one, I owe anything to no one. Wait, I, so you, you bootlicked once or twice? Yeah, yeah and I didn't that. like it, and I didn't like it, and I lost my respect because but, of that. You, that's, but did that's you get what you want? Did you get no, 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 no. You didn't get what I didn't, you wanted, I didn't, yeah. And you still lost rest. <laughs> yeah, and I see that. They see, <laughs> this, see, see, finish, see, finish, see, enter. Shy. That's why we bootlick it. See, finish, see, enter. Make I speak pigeon. Make I speak pigeon. <laughs> Make I speak everybody go, you understand you're, me? You're right, actually. You see, finish, go, enter. You understand? Yeah. So... If you like, for example, if you go to work and you're doing your job and you maintain and you maintain the status quo and you're doing what you're supposed to do, mm -hmm. if your boss if your boss oversteps his boundary, you can still tell him that, sir. You go call your guy to order. You go tell him. No, say you go insult him. Hey. Eh? No, me I not go to say. Eh, hey. yeah, if you <laughs> me like, no, 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 no. You get the way you go tell your boss. Your boss go look. Ah, okay. And from that moment on, you now begin to have that respect. Mm. You get so like that's why I said I'm on the side of now. Nah. And again. When you bootleg, you have you have suppressed belief in yourself. I keep saying it. Mm, so it's like a self-esteem issue. It's, it's a self-esteem issue. For me, it's a self-esteem issue. Oh, some, there are some people that they believe that, yeah, collaboration is good. You always have to work with people. You know, not just believe in yourself. You always have to work with people. But there are some people that they rely on it. They have, no, this, I have to work with this person. I have to, no, no, no. Sometimes you just have to look from inwards, outwards. You get me. I hear you. You're speaking. We've spoken very, very well. But is there a good time to bootleg? Because see, because it didn't work for you, doesn't mean that it won't work for another, or it hasn't worked for some others. I have had callers who have said it worked for me. In fact, right now I am still bootlegging. In fact, I am a yes man right now, and I have to be because that's what the the boss wants, and that is what some people regard as loyalty. Yeah, in all in all honesty, I feel like there there are times where you need to actually. I don't like it. <laughs> so I'll just, <laughs> I do I'll, personally. I'll the time, the time. Well, my scenario is different. So like, I I keep on like, I keep on attacking issues. I keep on treating issues from my own view, from my own scenario. Okay. So there are some people that they, they might not have choices. They might not have options. They might not have avenues mm -hmm. or alternatives mm -hmm. than to bootleg. So yeah, you yeah, if you have to do what you have to do to survive, yeah, do what you have to do to survive. But I am of the belief that nah, I know how many jobs I have lost because I've been bootleg. Ha. I know how many I can't. So you rather lose those jobs? For me, it's a, it's a personality. It's not just thing. to leak small mm, and come no. on out. And sometimes you not even leak in public. No. It's in private. No. Eh? <laughs> Nobody go know. No. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, nah. It's not. I'm. Not, I'm not even. I'm not even going to pretend about it. No, I'm that type of person. My family knows, my brothers, my all everybody around me knows. So for you, is he is he an ego thing then? Cause again, yeah, it's like me, MC Fish. You know, a creative a me. Some people see it as ego, but it's still not ego. See, <laughs> in my game, in 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 the hype game, I have people that are before me. I have senior colleagues. When I see them, I give them the respect. I treat them, you know. And I try to learn whatever thing I can learn from them. It doesn't mean the next day that I see them, I want to start calling them. I say, ah, bros, do you need to dry clean your clothes? Do you need to... I know people that, yeah, bootlegging has actually helped, but it's not in every case. In fact, it's not in most cases. It's not in most cases. It's just temporary solutions to permanent issues. Hmm. Deep. You want to get to the top. You have to get to the top based on your own merits. Getting to the top from down up means that you have to experience everything you have to learn everything that comes with rising to the top hmm. life is a journey you always have to we always have to understand that so but looking is the opposite like up down abby you are looking up so that you can abby how you said down up now abby. yes yes yeah. uh -huh. but looking is more like up down you're yeah like, like, to... you are trying to look up <laughs> uh -huh. you are there you are trying to look up but you are not understanding that you have a journey to go from down up hmm. 
Hey, are you sure you're just an MC? You're a deep thinker right here. <laughs> this is deep waters with Deborah Waters. I'm still right here with MC Fish in the building and yep. digging deep on the topic of the day, boot licking. In, a, in the quest to get into the top, is does boot licking play a major role? I'd love to hear your thoughts and your opinion. Do you agree with MC Fish? You know, are you a fan of MC Fish? Do you disagree? Do you have thoughts and opinions? Do you have questions? Feel free to join the conversation. Calling on 0705-993-6937 or 0705-993-7937. The num number to call to be a part of the conversation, again, is 0705-993-6937. Let's take another call now. Hello. Hello, Debbie. Yeah. Hi. Welcome back. Hi, yeah, my, I just want to appreciate my brother there. I've been listening to him. He really made a very valuable point. Okay. Which I've been uh, saying. Uh, you said earlier, which you mentioned? Uh, earlier, yes. Uh, see, I I believe I believe in myself and I believe in God. You get me? I don't know what the last caller said um, that. That you were just mentioning God, 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 God. Yeah, God. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Such a boss. You see, such a boss is that kind of a boss that can um, send someone to kill for him, to mm. steal for him, okay. to do all sorts of things just for his person to be, you know. What, what kind of conscience do you have? I know we are all humble. Everybody lives with his or her own conscience. I mean, at the end of the day, you want, to, you want your God to, 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 to love you. He will send you to do something that is... That that that's against your faith, against your belief, against your 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 humanity, against what you your your practice, against just because you want to get up there, then you have to take such a risk. You have to take such. Come on, what kind of life are we living? Then at the end of it, then when you do it and come back and uh, you promote you, then tomorrow you will live with that duty. Just like some of us used to say, I did this kind of thing in the past. I am still remembering it up to now. You are still living with that duty. You have so, so Afam, are step, you saying you that you've up? never boot licked before? Or you are a changed let, boot licker? Let me tell you something. We all served people. Before I became a boss, I served a boss. Okay. I served, in fact, my own service was in the boot league. I served a boss before I become my own. So I, 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 I believe what I'm supposed to do. And I know what I'm supposed to do. Exactly. And my organ knows very well that this kind of thing, I don't do it. And I will not do it. Interesting, Afam. Thank you for sharing. I appreciate So uh, that is what I want to say. So uh, it's good for somebody to know, put himself, uh, put, I mean, believe in himself and also know what he or she can do. Okay. Uh, he, can, he or she cannot do. Interesting. Thank you so much for sharing. I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. on what I have said. I feel I feel like um, boot licking is not always from a place of um, oh you're not enough or your your self esteem is um, is not there. Mm -hmm. Sometimes people strategically like it's just like oh me saying oh I'm full I'm I'm confident but saying oh I've noticed that this type of person to in order to get their favor or in order to get into what I want to get what I want mm -hmm. or get into some rooms that I want to get mm -hmm. this person I'm seeing likes boot lickers. So, because of that, I'm going to play the boot licking game with this person to get what I want. And when I do, I will vamoose. Okay, so what if, as you are in this process now of trying to get what you want, mm -hmm. like, is it, like you rightly said, you, you now find yourself doing a lot of things that are against your principles in the process. <laughs> Okay, for example, now you are a, you you are a devout Christian. Mm -hmm. You are you read your Bible every day. You you go to church when you're supposed. Even weekdays you go to church. And your boss <laughs> and you want to get a promotion. And your boss says, "Okay, you know what? I need someone to accompany me to the club this night." Mm -hmm. And you find yourself in the clubs. Mm. A lot of people are, have been lost like this. They're not saying she's grand. I'm not saying I'm not saying the clubs are bad, mm -hmm. <laughs> but when you are changing your principles to achieve something, yeah. you, are already, you are already losing it. Trust me, as, as human beings, we need to have principles and those principles should guide us in every day of our lives. So, yeah. So, like he said, he works for a boss. He knows what his job is. If he gets to the office and he does his job diligently, his boss will see it. Hmm. That's just what I believe. That's just what I feel. Do you think bosses are enablers of bootlickers? 
Um, it's not because I mean, why would I? Sometimes it might be that the person is a bootlicker normally, but sometimes you look at the boss and say, for me to get his attention or her attention, is that I have to bootlick. So, do they enable? Do they favor more bootlickers? Well, the ones that for it's it's a personality trait. Like mm. that's what that's why like I said I'm, I'm, I've worked with a lot of people in my life, of a lot of club owners. I've worked with uh, bootlickers. I have worked with ones that are not bootlickers, and I know how. It worked out for me. The truth is, <laughs> if you are working for a boss that is a bootlicky, Abby, <laughs> <laughs> that is a bootlicky, you have to bootlick to get extra favors. But one thing that I'm going to advise uh -huh. it doesn't stop your salary, it doesn't stop your pay. Whether you bootlick or not, it doesn't stop the agreement of payment that is between you and your boss. Uh -huh. So I feel like from the onset, you should be able to accept the fact that, okay, if I can't get anything extra from this man and because I have to bootleg, mm -hmm. I'm not going to do it. That's what the kind of person I am. Mm -hmm. If I if I look at myself, okay, I'm getting so some amount of my salary and I'm supposed to get extra favors and I know I'm going to get those extra favors if I just bootleg and do some little eye service mm -hmm. for this man. You understand? Mm -hmm. I am going to tell myself the truth that, look, my salary is enough for me. I'm good. Hey, it's what I tell people that. Hey, Likwa, which okay. salary is enough for you in this economy? I will be like some. Ugwani, which salary is enough for you in this economy? No, it's just the way it is. See, let, the truth Ugwani, is. Ugwani, let's this, be realistic. The oh. truth is, we cannot keep. See, mm. it's not easy for anybody. That's just the truth. It's not. Easy, it's not easy for any, even your boss that wants to pay for you. It's not Why easy for you. People are carrying this but looking too deep. Sometimes it's not even that deep. It's not saying we not. It's not going to break against your, uh, your principles. You don't go you break. You go and need that and ask for forgiveness. Well, I, mean, I trust my right. God. My God go for me. <laughs> no one, no one. So, I'm but just, I'm just trying to. Be, I'm being. I'm playing the devil, devil's advocate here. I'm being a realist. You know, mm -hmm. and times where people do don't do this, but looking for for their salary, they know their salary is short. It's for the extra favors, it's for the promotion, it's for the extra gigs. You know, it's for entering some rooms, some getting some contracts. Yeah, I know, I know, I un I perfectly understand, but I still feel look, merit would always work for you. I know, I'm in the nightlife scene. I know there are, there are some things people will say about me that they'll be like, no, 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 this is not MC Fish. MC Fish can't do this. <laughs> if it's that okay. You had the problem with them to fish is money. Maybe you didn't pay him. That's how that's kind of person I am. So I feel like merit would always take you farther than any uh, other. I thing. think I agree with that. Merit will always take you farther. And if and if especially if you're wonderful at your job. You are, you, you are very, very good at your job. Oh, you don't need to good league to get to where you are going to. Okay. You understand? <laughs> <laughs> because I'm trying to change your night. Yeah, <laughs> you can move it closer. Yeah, yeah. Uh, sorry. So if you're wonderful at your job, mm -hmm. you will get there. Trust me, you have not gotten there does not mean you will not get there. It yeah. is your life journey to be where you are so you can understand and experience and learn from that stage to move to the next one. Interesting. That yeah. makes sense. <laughs> that yeah. really makes sense. Yeah. I was going to ask, uh, sometimes there's a, there's a difference. Is there a difference between networking and bootlicking? Because yeah, yeah you know, there is. Because, you know, when you're networking too, especially when they are bigger than you or higher than you, you literally have to sprinkle some bootlicking there. Like appreciating mm. them when you you know there's nothing there's no big deal about what they're doing yeah. and stuff. Yeah. And who, what's the boundary there? Well, huh, it's a very thin line, actually. <laughs> it's a very very thin line. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very very thin line. The truth is, I will network. I will meet people. I will meet people in my field, mm -hmm. but I won't bring myself to the level of bootlicking. Like, and I'm calling you every day. I feel like once I network and meet somebody, we exchange numbers, we exchange contact, we exchange social media. You already know what I do. I already know what you do. At some point, we are going to do business together. For example, now, if it's your birthday and I wish you happy birthday, I'm not bootlicking. It's your birthday. I wish you happy birthday now. Mm. Which which is happy birthday? Emoji now. Uh -huh. you, you, you do it on WhatsApp. Go on do, Instagram. Well, it's not that. Facebook. Not, that's the person's they birthday. They send SMS. That no no no. You don't. You don't need, uh -huh. An email. No, nah, that that one I would look at. That one I would look at. Just a, I'm just saying, just little, you know, some little little um courtesy calls. That's just it. But but looking now, you are going to the person's house. You are calling the person three times a week. For if, okay, an example. If what is the person itself does not even like bootlick, you now become a disturbance to the person. Yeah, yeah. It always, it, and, and you know this thing can backfire. Yes, I was going to, uh, you know, 
And when it backfires, it's, it's like your case. It becomes a situation where you lost your see finish client. They will not block you. You see finish. You see that see finish. Eh? My people, see, when I look me, <laughs> avoid see finish. Anything you do for this life, avoid, leave all this English that I speak. You are uh, boot looking, this, 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 that. Avoid see finish. Oh, you know, good. Whether you're networking, whether you're boot looking, mm -hmm. try avoid see finish. Yeah. Because that's just the truth. Yeah. So, when you're doing that back to back and it backfires, you lose your self respect. You're not getting what you want. So, mm -hmm. it's better. I always say it, it's better to get the merits and to get the rewards with the experience. A lot of people are, are wealthy, but they are not experienced with money. Before you become wealthy mm -hmm. physically, you have to be wealthy in the mind. So. If you believe in yourself, that belief, huh, that belief trump past anything. Yeah. Me, I've always believed that. Look, I'm, I'm just getting started with whatever thing I want. If you people think I've achieved anything, I have not. I'm just starting. I keep telling people, but it's it's what I believe. Yes. So my belief will take me. And to you don't anyone. have to put leak. Uh, my belief has taken me out of this country a couple of times. So, I'm getting somewhere. Mm -hmm. It might not happen as fast as I want it to, but I'm... Or as I'm, fast as when you are booklet. Yeah, uh, just uh, hey, when I'm booklet, but I'm on the side of, don't <laughs> worry, I will do it at my own pace. Interesting. Yeah. Very, very well said. And what would you say to somebody who, um, you know, bootlegs or it has become a habit for them? I think some people cannot even help it. You know, you, you see people who mm -hmm. are, um, they are just that one person that will just... Um, answer all the questions and uh, um, have all the answers go the extra mile for the boss you know just do extra 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 and it's mm -hmm. become a habit you mm -hmm. know mm -hmm. maybe because of situations where it has worked for them in the past or mm -hmm. or mm -hmm. maybe even grew up in an environment where boot licking is the thing you know and you've taken it up and it's become a habit for you and so far it's, it has worked but at some point you know they, you hear things like oh or aj uj like this one works or it did not work. Or it did not work for this one. It doesn't mean that it will it will work for this one and, and stuff like that. So if you are in someone in that situation where you know they are they are just there, it's a habit for them. You know what would you say? Well, um, to the person that has been that is in this scenario <laughs> that has been bootlicking. Uh, well, you're at this point now. That's what I'm going to tell you. You're at this point, but at every opportunity you find yourself to believe in yourself and your merit, please take it. Trust me, it's less stress. Okay, for example, you want to bootleg your boss. You will spend, if you are going to see the man in his house, you spend transport. You use credits. <laughs> you do this. Sometimes you have to stress yourself physically going somewhere. Yeah, going but one credit alert can solve the problem for Maga. Maga can look at you and just say, make I give you this thing now. Don't okay. be so the video they give Israel. No, I uh, do we see if <laughs> no, be so. Uh, they, they, but if uh, Israel travel around the world, though. Uh, but it's not better if Israel was. Israel, it's not Israel better if Israel was be. doing a specific job in DMW, and any time he goes on this trip with them, he doesn't have to shout and he's get, he gets paid. It's not better. I don't know. Because I, don't, I don't know how much Israel has in his accounts. Ah, Israel, uh, not me. I don't know. First of all, you but it's, it's just for me. It's just better than doing that. Trust me. But the truth is, the truth is, it's fun. It's, it's something we all look forward to. So, yeah. What, like I said. What do we all look forward to? Emailing him now. <laughs> him, um, he's, he's a day playing. No, that was him bootlicking. Him bootlicking, exactly. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, 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 yeah, like I said, yes. you have found yourself here. Maybe some people have special talents. Could it be a talent? It's a talent, actually. <laughs> It's actually the time because I have see I have tried a couple of times to even I want I I wish I know how to do it. So you get but <sighs> but you don't want to overshare, you don't want to over overdo mm. you know. So like I said, you to the person you find yourself at this point, but at every opportunity you have to believe in your merit, to believe in your value, you need to bootleg. If I get to a company today, aside from the back fact that I'm an MC. I want to add value, extra value, so that I won't have to bootleg. For example, if you employ me as a club as a hype man now, I'm not only going to come to work for you as a hype man. I will help you with my experience in nightlife. I have done 12 years in clubs. Wow. Yeah. So, that value alone that I am bringing to the table, bootlegging is out of the park already. 
interesting. And yeah. I, I think with leaking, even when for an extended period of time, you start to lose yourself completely. You, you lose yourself. You, you begin to lose yourself. You now start... Okay, at some point, there are some people that are going deep. They now start looking like their bosses. They now, they now want to be dressing like their... You know, you know they say, um, you're not, you're not to just... Uh, I mean, I, not, I mean, some religious organizations, I think I have, you know, some of them would do the hairstyle of the boss. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, well, I think we are, we are, like we are both at the same bus stop. So, <laughs> so yeah. So, let's, let's leave like that. Yeah, <laughs> let's not go let's too not deep. Go too deep. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So, yeah, you've been to lose yourself. So, so that's it. Uh, like, Interesting. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yes, indeed. That was um, MC Fish, you know, giving us deeper perspective on uh-huh. the topic of the day. Put yep. Licking, MC Hype Man, Music A&R, Nightlife, Influencer, and Billonia. Eh? Billonia. Oh, yeah, Gikashi. Talking and spending. Where my money there, babe? I'm not sending that one. I don't mind boot licking you. Okay, give me my money. Nah, no, no, no. Eh? I'm not. I don't believe in boot licking now. <laughs> so you don't go know, say they boot lick you. Ah, uh, no. I will know. Don't <laughs> worry. I will know. I'm on the other side. Don't worry. I will know. Thank you so much for coming on the show and for You're honoring us with, um, with your presence. I really appreciate it. You've given us pleasure. really deeper perspective. And yep. who knows that a hype man can actually, you know, just. You know, take us to the deep waters and back. Yeah, I have those sides. I know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know. So, my callers and listeners, thank you so much for calling and for being a part of the show. This has been Deep Waters with Deborah Waters. And I'm sure you were able to learn one or two things about getting to the top. Uh, and does boot leaking play a major role? Well, according to MC Fish, no, it doesn't. And I'm sure you have your own answers, personal answers, and your personal perspective. Whatever you deduce from this show, uh, just make sure you are true to yourself and true to your to your life basically my name is deborah waters thanks for joining for myself and mc fish we say bye-bye ciao